Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. In this one, I wanted to cover a subscriber request on how we can remove special characters from our Excel worksheets programmatically. We'll do this using Python and Pandas. Let's look at our data first and then we'll get started. Here in our Excel workbook, we just have a little bit of data. However, in this data, we have a lot of special characters that don't belong. So let's see how we can use Python to remove these special characters. The first thing I'm gonna do before we leave Excel is I'll format these, I'll format all these cells to just have a data type of text. This might save us a few headaches later on. Now that we had that, let's go ahead and open up our text editor. We'll be using pandas, so go ahead and import pandas as pd, and then we need the Excel file path. I'm working in the same directory, so mine will just be the name of my Excel file. So office info.xlsx. And then, like always, we'll create a data frame where we read in this Excel workbook using the Excel file path. Let's go ahead and verify that we've read this in. So we'll say df, and then let's just return the first two lines. We'll save this and open up a terminal. We'll execute, so Python 3, and then my name is removecharacters.py. We get back the first two rows, so we know that we've successfully read in our Excel file into our data frame. Before we apply this to the entire data frame, let's apply it to just one column to see how it works. We'll pull out a column by saying df, and using square brackets, let's pull out the name column. So we'll take that column, paste it here. The first thing we need to do is to make sure that the data type that we have is a string. We can do that by applying the str method. And now pandas has a super convenient method that we can apply to a column within our data frame. This method is called replace. So we can use replace. Now we could use the replace method and put in only the characters that we want to replace. However, that would be a long process because you might have a lot of special characters that you're looking to try to replace. So instead, let's use a regular expression or regex to identify only certain patterns. In our case, we want to keep everything that isn't a special character. We can do this by denoting a regular expression using an R. We'll put an apostrophe to denote the string and then we'll use a backslash to start our regular expression. Well, since we want all the letters and all the numbers to remain intact, we need to select only the special characters. We could put a lowercase w here, and that would select all of the letters and all of the numbers. However, we want everything but those to be selected so we can remove them. So we can do that by using a capital W. This is the inverse of the lowercase w when it comes to regular expressions. We'll end that string and put a comma, and now we need to pass in what we want to replace those special characters. In our case, we just want to get rid of them, so we can use an empty string. So talking through this line, we're taking the data frame column of name, converting whatever data type is in it to a string, which it should already be since we did that in Excel. We're replacing everything that matches this regular expression, which is everything that is not a number and not a letter, and replacing it with an empty string. However, right now we're not saving this information because we're not assigning it to the same column. So let's assign it to the name column by setting that equal to this statement. If we were to print df, we should see that all the special characters have been removed from that name column. When we get the result, we see that all of our names now have no special characters. What if we wanted to apply this to the entire data frame instead of having to go column by column and doing the same operation. We could use a for loop. Now I'm using a for loop here even though it might be a little bit slower because your subscriber doesn't have that much data and I think it's a little bit easier to understand. So we'll use that here, but there's other solutions too. So let's create our for loop. We'll say for column in all the columns in our data frame. We can access these by using the attribute columns. So now we're using every column within our data frames columns. Instead of using name here, we can delete these and put column and then column. Once we have that, we need to follow Python syntax and indent this over because of this for statement. Now let's go ahead and execute this. Once we execute this, we get the result that we wanted and we removed all the special characters from each of the columns in our worksheet. Let's output this to a new Excel sheet. So I'll say df to Excel, all lowercase, and we'll put it removed characters 
xlsx. We'll execute this, go back to my desktop, and we'll open it up. Now we have a workbook that has no special characters inside of it. And that's pretty much it for this one. If you have any suggestions for future videos, please let me know. If you have any questions or comments about this one, please let me know that too. Until next time.